I'm Tracy Everman. I'm a family nurse practitioner with IU Health, and I've been in practice since 2011. I became a nurse practitioner because when I worked in the hospital as a bedside nurse, I noticed that I would see the same patients coming in repeatedly for flare-ups of chronic disease conditions, congestive heart failure, diabetes, on their second or third heart uh, cath for um, coronary artery disease. And I just would think to myself, wouldn't it be nice to have the opportunity to get in front of these patients six months ago, prior prior to them being in the, in the hospital bed in a state of distress. So eventually I furthered my education and put myself in position to have that opportunity to intervene early and hopefully cut down on those flare-ups of those disease processes. When patients meet me for the first time, my main goal is to make them feel comfortable with, with our visit, help them feel relaxed in you know, a new environment with a new provider so that they're able to really explain to me in detail what their health goals are. And in addition to that, I want them to feel confident that I'm going to help them meet those goals. And I really stress the importance of teamwork to, to achieve those, those goals. What I love most about my job is coming across a patient that's been maybe labeled as non-compliant or perceives themselves as a bad patient uh, based on prior experiences. What I've found in most of those cases is there are just barriers to them being at their optimal state of health. I, I don't think that anybody chooses to be unhealthy or is satisfied with a suboptimal level of health. So uh, I enjoy really kind of breaking things down, identifying those barriers and problem solving with the patients to get through them. Sometimes that's connecting them with resources to help with that. Um, and those may be financial resources, resources to get them more affordable medication, uh, but, but just really determining what's gotten in the way uh, thus far of them being at the best level of health that they could be at. When I'm not caring for patients, I'm in full-on mom mode. I have two daughters who are very active uh, girls. I have one that is an avid golfer and is a musician and another one that plays both volleyball and travel softball. So the majority of my time outside of work is spent running to and from practices and embarrassing them with sideline cheers. <laughs>